linked genes genes are said to be linked if they are placed on the same chromosome and if they are very close to each other usually linked genes they inherit together linkage is defined as failure of the segregation of the uh, chromosomes during the process of meiosis closer the two genes will be there will be more chances that there is no crossover and the genes they will inherit together from the parents to the offsprings the crossing over can be measured in the terms of units one person crossover means that one map unit one map unit mean the chromosomes they are closely linked they are not far away from each other they will inherit as a unit from the parents to the offsprings but on the other hand if we say that the recombinant frequency is 12% it means they are far away from each other 12 map units 12 map units mean they are far from each other there is too much distance between these two type of the uh, genes so there is possibility that they will be they will have a cross with each other crossover fre frequency is measured in terms of map units or map distance we can see here that how linkage and linked genes can be understand here is the example of chromosome 15 in case of chromosome 15 this is the first copy of one of the homologous chromosome this is a second copy of the second homologous chromosome because uh, chromosomes they are in homologous forms the sequence of the genes which are present on the first uh, copy of the chromosome 15 is a b c and d while the sequence of the genes or the placement of the genes on the second copy of the homologous is that can be written as capital a b and c d so when they are separated during the process uh, during the process of meiosis what we will say that what is linkage one set during the anaphase of meiosis one set if receives a b c d copy of the chromosome 15 while the second set receives a b c d it mean that there is no crossover between these genes or between these alphabets here a can be considered uh, gene 1 b gene 2 c gene 3 and d gene 4 if the sequence is same that was present on the sequence of the chromosome which were present in the parents if this sequence is not changed they are in the same sequence a b c d then we will say that the genes they are linked together and they are not um, separated from each other and there is no crossover such a genes they are called as linked genes to further understand the phenomena what is the meaning of uh, uh, linked and recombinant in case of recombinant here we can see that it was a b that was exchanged with the chromatid of the second homologous a b it has become c and d that was uh, on the other chromatid of the other homologous chromosome same is here but in case of that what will be the linked genes if the same sequence comes in the offsprings or in the daughter cells then we will say that the genes they are linked if they exchange the parts then we will say that this is the recombinant and if they do not change the parts then they are called as linked genes linked genes they inherit in the form of unit or in the form of blocks this phenomena is particularly used for the identification of the many disease genes in case of human where a linkage analysis is used to identify certain regions where there is a location of a gene that is causing a particular phenotype or is causing a mutation that is responsible for a phenotype